It's the Money Boys Podcast with DJ Swear De Niro and M Dollars right here on Swear TV. You say, oh, you already know. Don't don't act like that. You know I got two football teams I love. I love my 49ers. I got the poster up here like we talked about last time. You it should subscribe to the channel. You know, I got some artwork right here where you see the bottom of the San Francisco 49ers logo, but this is my other squad. But I had to put this on for today's podcast. Why? Maybe some people don't care. They might not care. Mm-hmm. But I love the Raiders. The Raiders. Oh, there you go. There you go. I love my Raiders. I'm just saying I wore the hat today for today's podcast to get straight into it that, <clears throat> according to sources, Colin Kaepernick, he worked out for the Las Vegas Raiders. Yeah, when you're a quarterback, this is how you always start. You start with sticks and, and quick outs and hitches to make sure you get lathered up and see the ball caught, see the ball going through the hands. And as you can see at this onset here, he's making really good throws and they're on target. And the ball placement is very important. Outside shoulder on hitches and on the outside shoulder on these outs. Just like that. How you feel about that play, boy? I feel like shout out to Colin Kaepernick. <laughs> Finally getting a chance, getting another opportunity to step foot on the uh on the football field. So. And, and it's his first workout since being kind of like can I use the word uh I don't know, just not being a part of the NFL. Yeah, yeah. It's his so, first workout, like a Fisher joint, I guess, you know, from sources. Yeah, so yeah, I'm I'm excited. I, at at this point, just to be honest, mm-hmm. I don't care about the team. Mm-hmm. I'm just excited that he gets a chance to perform on the national football team. Somebody's uh national football team. I I don't care what, what team it is. I just wanna see the brother go out, do something. Do it big. I hope. I hope they take um, him serious. The organization. If not, it is what it is. But shout out to Colin Kaepernick. And, I, and, and by all means, brother, get your bag. One thing I want to say about Colin Kaepernick. If you haven't seen, uh, I don't know if it's like a, a season two, but he did a dope situation on Netflix where he kind of like used like this young actor who kind of show his story. Mm-hmm. Of his journey of trying to be a, a quarterback in high school football, it's dope. On it's so crazy. I cannot think of the name of that joint on Netflix, but you gotta check that out. Gotcha. My question is that he's thirty four years old now. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Do you think he still can make an impact if he's signed? Because you know they got Derek Carr. You know Derek Carr is our starting starting quarterback for the Las Vegas Raiders. But do you think he'll be a dope as backup quarterback? Yes. Why? I would say experience. Um, before he exited the game, it was not because of his performance. It was simply because he took a knee. Didn't have anything to do with his performance on the actual field. So I think certain things like that, you you just don't get rid of it. They don't. They don't just fall away. Like you can ask me the same question, and this is a I, I'm reaching, but y'all get the example. Like To, <laughs> To was To. To was in shape. He could, you know, what I'm saying he could be a good backup for anybody. I see the same thing as Colin Kaepernick. You got a younger, younger guy that's still in shape. He's not suffering from no injuries. He's not coming back into the game with pre-existing injuries. So. Yeah, man, I, I think, I think, honestly, he could start back up without a shot of a doubt, without a question, no doubt. Start for any other franchise? I, 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 I'm not going to say any. Uh, he could start. I said any other. Like, what, what yeah, franchise um, could he start at? <laughs> right now, if you know, you know, I know you know your football. The Commanders. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> well, no, that might, that's ill. I mean, uh, people are going to disagree with us, but. I think. What if he did start for the commander? <laughs> what if he did? We still gonna lose. I don't know, man. We still gonna lose, man. I mean, I, I I can't disagree with you, and I can't agree with. You. I'm just gonna say I don't know. I don't know. I need to see him play in the NFL game. You know, he been out the game for a minute. Mm-hmm. I feel I feel the sound effect. I just don't know. He gotta show us. So here's the thing. So you got the owners, right? The owners accept them, but then you break it down to. The the teammates to the locker room. 
what is the impact on the locker room having Colin Kaepernick coming back to a team? Any any team. I any th- team. It it could be it could be split. It could be in three situations. You could have a agree, disagree, and a neutral. I feel like that's what you got, which is a black, white, and a gray area. Because you know what they're gonna say, right? Well, uh, it's it's the offensive line. Are they gonna block for him? Are they gonna block for him? Well, I'm thinking more for the, the team trying to wanting to block for him. If you get what I mean, mm-hmm. like okay, damn, you took a check. Why you back now trying to get a starting position? Or I salute the brother. I'm glad he's back. I'm gonna block my ass off for him. That's where I'm coming from. It like mm-hmm. I don't know. We got to see what he can do. You know, what I'm saying if he playing the preseason game, I mean. I just gotta see him play, dog. I want to see how the, how everything you just said. How the locker room gonna be when the cameras is in there, mm-hmm. when the players are being interviewed. If he makes this team, if he makes it to the Las Vegas Raiders, mm-hmm. and he doesn't. He he might not play no game in this upcoming, you know, 22-23 season. Right. As long as he got a jersey on, mm-hmm. and I know people might be disagreeing with that when they burn all the old jerseys and all that. Whatever well, you feel, that's cool. That's your opinion. You know, what I'm saying opinions is just like. We all got one. But for him to be in the NFL, to get a chance to try for a team, shit. Get that man a chance. Kudos. <laughs> DJ Swords and Everett M Dollars. And of course, this is the Money Boys Podcast. Already. What you guys think in the comment section? Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Let's go. Notification gang. Hey.